Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erica. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. I'm a single mom of three and we do mobile home living. And on my channel, you will see pretty much any and everything that relates to being a mom from cleaning. I do a lot of cleaning motivation. I do some makeover, mobile home makeovers because I'm in the process of making over my home. I do grocery hauls, um, shopping, day in the life. The only thing you won't see a lot of on my channel is cooking just because I hate cooking. Um, so if you enjoy that type of content, I hope you will subscribe and join our family. So today, you guys, in this video, I am going to be cleaning, decluttering, and organizing my laundry room because right now I'm in the process of making over the kids' bathroom. And then once I get done with that, I want to make over my laundry room um but that's something that's a project that i can't start yet because i had to replace my back door if you've been here before you've heard me talk about this when i did um laundry um i had to replace my back door because there was a leak and i have to wait for my brother to get a chance to come back and finish putting the sheetrock back up on the walls where he had to cut it out because it was kind of rotten um so i can't do the makeover until i get that fixed um, which I'm hoping he's already started it. He's got one side done. Um, he just has to mud it. And then he's got to finish putting the sheetrock on the other side and get it kind of mudded or get it mudded. And then once that's done, I do want to do a makeover. But before I do start the makeover, I wanted to kind of declutter the pantry and kind of get it organized um, just to see what I needed for the makeover. Um, as you can see here, I'm putting my la my laundry pods and my OxyClean and the little scent boosters in jars. I already had these jars. Um, they are from Walmart. I think they were like five or six dollars. They were very cheap. Um, but I wanted to go through and just de get it cleaned and decluttered um, so that I know what I what else I needed to get to get it kind of organized before I did the makeover um, so I got pretty much above the washing machine done but I still need to get a few things for over the dryer um, but yeah that's what today's video will entail so I hope you guys get some motivation to clean or declutter or just organize whatever area in your home you need to organize and I hope you guys enjoy the video Hello, how'd you do? I'm not broken, I'm just split in two Hope you're fine, ain't got time To do everything you said you would Frames of the past and The memory of you just come running by Pictures of sunny days With your smile and the power I was broken How could they say you made me come undone Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them oh. How could they say I was broken How could they say you made me come undone Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them So y'all, this here is what made me really want to go ahead and get this laundry room cleaned and decluttered because it's kind of become sort of the catch-all room because I don't have very much storage and I told you guys that I'm trying to make over my home. So you can see here, I this is where I store all my paint trays and my paint rollers and all of my um, just stuff that I have to have for the makeovers. Um, 
so this is where it's been I've been storing it so this is just like the catch-all area and also I have all my cleaning stuff back in here just because I had a leak under the kitchen sink and it was really bad and it actually messed up the bottom part of the cabinet so um I have my brother's gonna replace that for me but until he gets that replaced I can't really put anything under there and that's where I store most of my cleaning supplies so right right now I've just been storing everything in the laundry room um, but I hope to have be able to put it under the cabinet soon um, and then also I need to get a couple bins to put some of this stuff in to just be able to put on the rack above the dryer um, but I do want to when I do the makeover I want to get rid of those wire racks because when I read they're so high um, I can barely reach them and then on top of that they're not very deep I guess so it's like I have to reach over the washer and the dryer just to reach whatever is up there um, so I do want to replace the wire racks and I want to do like some floating maybe do two floating shelves above the washer and then if I can fit a cabinet because as you can tell my laundry room is not very big um, but if I can fit a cabinet I would like to have a cabinet above the dryer but if not then I'll probably just put two sh two floating shelves up there as well um, but I'd like to have a cabinet just for to use for storage so that I can store like all my pen maybe like the acrylic and the painters tape and stuff like that I can store that inside the cabinet and even though nobody goes in my laundry room but me um, it'll still be hidden and I won't I won't see it and it won't bug me um, but that's just a few of the things that I want to do in the laundry room once I get to do the makeover um, but as y'all can see it definitely definitely needed to be clean and decluttered and I wanted to do that before I bought the bins because I didn't want to buy bins that I didn't really need even though I probably could use them somewhere else in my home um, to organize some things but I just didn't want to spend money unnecessary money if that makes sense um, so yeah if let me know leave me a comment down below and let me know if you have a space in your home that's kind of like a catch-all place because you don't have a lot of storage so you just kind of throw everything in that one place and it just it catches everything leave me a comment and let me know down below was broken how could they say you made me come undone now i know that it's okay unlike my friends you are nothing like them oh. how could they say i was broken how could they say you made me come undone now i know that it's okay unlike my friends you are nothing like them you do I'm not broken I'm just split in two hope you're fine and got time I'm not broken not broken not broken how could they say I was broken how could they say you made me come undone now I know that it's okay unlike my friends you are nothing like them To my life, such a magic feeling when you tore down my walls. I wish I could go back to right before you told me I'd try to change it all. 
But look at us now, could have gone so far It hurts to realize we're parted Y'all, this is what I mean about the shelves and how high they are and how far back they are. Um, as you can see, they don't come out very far on the walls. Um, so they're not very deep and they don't hold a lot. Um, and also, I'm actually standing on a step stool right now. I had to get the step stool to actually be able to put this stuff back up there because I just couldn't reach. Um, and there is still a lot of stuff up here. Um on the shelf so it may still look a little cluttered um but it's actually not it's just there's no there wasn't much space for everything so i want to do get one i oh my gosh you guys i want to get a few bins that i can put the stuff in to maybe hide some of the stuff or just to keep it so that it doesn't look so cluttered and it'll the bins will bins will make it look a little more organized and then i also want to get something that i can put the the puppies training pads in um, just so I don't have to have that big bulky box and then I also need to get another glass jar to put that Epsom salt in and then I need to get a, a probably a bigger probably two I probably need two glass jars one for the Epsom salt and then one to put my dryer balls in because you can see I have two balls and one small dryer and then the rest of them are in the bag uh, because I didn't have any like big any more big jars to put them in so I do need to pick up two more glass jars and then a couple bins um, to put up there. And then I did label everything. You will see me do that here in a few minutes. Um, but yeah, I, I just wanted y'all to see like how high they are and how non-functional these racks actually are. I don't know why they put them in there. And also, y'all, I'm sorry about the angles. This laundry room is just so small. It was so hard to really get a good angle so you guys could see what I was doing um, so if there's times where you can't see what I'm doing because of the angle I'm so sorry I do apologize for that um, but yeah I just wanted y'all to, to know that if you couldn't tell which I'm sure you could that I had to get a step stool just to be able to reach up here Look at us now. This is who we are. And I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again, again, again Strangers again, again, again We're like strangers again, again, again I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again
world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. Birds will sing about your heart. Maybe the trees will whisper the word. Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope. Alright you guys, so this video is coming to an end. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I hope you got lots of motivation to either clean, declutter, organize, whatever you need to do. I hope you got some motivation to do it. I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me. And as always, please leave me a pink heart in the comments down below if you made it to the end of this video. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye y'all.